welcome. I'm gonna show you how to make an old fashioned. Um, it happens to be Daryl's favorite um, evening drink. Um, after we've had dinner and um, in the evening, he loves it. So um, this is my recipe um, and I do it just a tad bit different. So I'm gonna show you what I do. First of all, bourbon. It's the best. We're using Blanton's. Everybody knows what this cute little bottle is. Um, and so we're using Blanton's today. Um, a little bit of orange. Um, instead of making my simple syrup, which I did not make um, from scratch, you certainly can. Water and sugar um, boiled on the stove, half and half. It'll uh, melt down, it'll be beautiful. I'm using Monin um, pure cane syrup. Um, so we're gonna use that um, tonight. Okay, so I've got some ice cubes. I've got my glass ready. Um, I almost forgot the bitters. We're using orange bitters. I get this from Woodford Reserve. You can now get it at Liquor Barn. Um, but there's something about going into the um, distilleries and shopping for certain things like that. And so this is where I get it. I get it at the distillery in Woodford County. And so um, my hometown. And so that's what we're gonna do. So I'm super excited. Now, a lot of people, a lot of my girlfriends don't really care that much for bourbon. Um, and so I'm, I'm trying to, how I started to like it was mixing it with a little bit of lemonade, um, which is super fantastic. Um, but this is a great drink. It's a good summer drink too. You can do after dinner and, but it's got that orange flavor and it's got a little bit of sweetness. Um, and so it's perfect at the end of a, of a busy day. So we're gonna get our ice cubes um, in our cup. We're gonna use two ounces of, mm, mm. oh my gosh, it smells beautiful. We're gonna do two ounces. That's two ounces. You know how much I love to, to measure. Um, we're gonna take an orange, the end of an orange, and we're gonna put it all over the glass and all over the rim. And this will uh, kind of get down into the into the ice. Um, we are going to drop in one, two, three, four drops of orange bitters. Mm. And it just, mm, it has this aroma. It's, it's beautiful. It's got a, a beautiful, um, smell to it. And then we are going to stir our cocktail for 30 seconds. You want to get that ice, that ice needs to a little bit melt. You don't want it watery, but you need it nice and cold. I sometimes will stick these glasses in, um, in my freezer, probably a half an hour before I um, make this cocktail for Daryl and the, the glass is nice and cold and um, it's a beautiful thing. So we're gonna continue to mix this. Mm. And then we're gonna mix it some more in just a second. We're gonna do about a half an ounce of your simple syrup. Continue to mix for another 10, 15 seconds. Mm. Also get these, um, now this is a bigger mixing um, from Woodward Reserve and I love that as well, but I love that copper spoon. Um, I already cut my orange peel, you know, to make it fancy and pretty and nice for him. Um, and. Mm, it's just gonna put a, a nice aroma in your drink. So I, I peeled that, I'm gonna stick it in there. And I've got these great um, bourbon cherries and I get them at Liquor Barn. They come in this little jar. Um, they're Daryl's absolute favorite. So I have some of those. I'm gonna drop one in there. And there is your beautiful, beautiful cocktail. A bourbon old fashioned. Mm. There's just something about bourbon in Kentucky. I hope you make this cocktail and I hope you have a great weekend.